these two parts of this problem are very similar, so I'm just going to focus on the second one here, and uh, we're going to need to see some SOHCAHTOA. And what I really need is the tangent and the sine. You're going to need the cosine for the first part here, but I don't need it for this. I'm just doing the second part. So we have sine theta equals opposite over hypotenuse, and the TOA is tangent theta equals opposite over adjacent. So from here, uh, what we need to do is, re I'm just going to rewrite our original problem, tangent of sine inverse four of four-fifths. So we're starting with this. And I'm going to let uh, theta equal sine inverse of four-fifths. All right, we're going to move the sine function to the other side. So this is sine inverse. If I move it to the other side, it's just sine of theta equals four-fifths. And this is where SOHCAHTOA is going to come into play. Four-fifths is opposite over hypotenuse. Now, if you have a negative value, I don't see any negative values here. If you have a negative value, you're not in quadrant one. You're either in quadrant two or four, and that gets a little bit more tricky. But we don't need to worry about that here. Everybody's positive. We're in quadrant one. So I'm going to draw a quadrant one triangle. This in quadrant one because both sides are positive. If I draw the xy axis, it looks like this. So opposite is four. Hypotenuse is five. I need to find the adjacent. I'll call it A. You have A squared plus 4 squared equals 5 squared. Square all these out. A squared equals uh, 5 squared is 25. 4 squared is 16. So you just subtract that 16 over. So A is plus or minus square root. 25 minus 16 is 9. Uh, so A is plus or minus 3. We're in quadrant one, so everybody's positive. So you're just going to go with the plus three, not the minus three. All right, we're not done yet, but uh, we know something about the angle theta right here. So this, the whole reason we did this, what I'm underlining here is going to, we called it theta, so I'm going to swap it out for theta. And we know tangent is opposite over adjacent and we have all those sides now opposite is 4 adjacent is 3 so that'll be the 4 thirds right there